What is up guys, Greedy Knight here talking about Rampage weapons. I've been farming for the materials to showcase what are the ideal builds for each and every weapon. I'll go over their meta viability so you can decide whether to run them for yourself. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more content like this, don't forget to drop a like and consider subscribing to stay updated with future content. Let's get into it. Rampage weapons have 210 raw, natural blue sharpness, zero affinity, and no slots. It has 6 levels worth of upgrades, each requiring an apex part from one of the 6 until you reach the final form. It is the only weapon line in the game that has at minimum 3 ramp up skills and the ability to layer. All of the ramp up skills let you customize your weapon to become any type of weapon in the game. If there is a bad weapon line, most rampage weapons can replace them. This is the meta build for Rampage skills from what I've seen. This is more of a template if anything. Sharpness 1 hits white sharpness with 1 point in handicraft. Paired with protective polish and speed sharpening, you can maintain white sharpness for the entire hunt. Non-element attack up is a general skill to use, but most of the element skills are good choices. Teostra and Camellios invalidate any poison or blast builds. Affinity Surge helps with crit builds, Attack Surge is pretty much used exclusively on blunt builds, while Element Surge depends on what your second slot was. Affinity Surge is just a placeholder because it does reduce your raw attack for the extra affinity, so use the weapon specific skills if it would benefit your specific weapon. For example, Charge Blade's weapon specific skill is changing your file type to Element, which is terrible, so you will want to stick with Affinity Surge. On the other hand, Dual Blades get a second element and a boost to your second ramp up skill element by 10 points, making it better than Affinity Surge. Use your knowledge of your particular weapon to use different skill combinations for various builds. Gunner weapons are considered meta because they have at least 5 ramp up slots, granting complete control over what ammo types, coatings, and shot types you will use. Bow has 6 ramp up slots, allowing you to make any bow that is tailor made to your particular build. On the other hand, the Blade Masters are limited to 3 ramp up slots, half of them sacrificing affinity surge for a weapon specific ramp up skill. Switch Axe, Gun Lance, Insect Glaive, Dual Blades, and Hunting Horn have notable skills in the 3rd slot, so they can be used to customize and have meta stats, akin the Gunner. Great Sword, Sword and Shield, Long Sword, Lance, and Hammer do not have a 3rd slot gimmick, so the only function the Rampage weapons serve is to replace a bad element or status weapon. The main benefit from using Rampage weapons is that you can weapon layer them. You can use any transmog to have your weapon match your specific armor set design. There is a running joke that fashion hunting is the true endgame of Monster Hunter, but with Rampage weapons, it gives fashion hunters a meta layered option to pair with their layered sets. If you do not know anything about a weapon type and you want to try it out, Rampage is the best weapon line to craft until you learn the ropes. Not all Rampage weapons are the best in their weapon type, but they can serve as training wheels for learning how to use a weapon. The damage output is solid, you can use any weapon or armor build, and the materials are easy to farm for. They use common materials so you don't have to hope for a 3% drop just to max out your meta weapon. Rampage is an expensive endgame weapon line. It will cost more Zenny and more materials to fully upgrade. During the endgame, Zenny shouldn't be a problem, but you will have to endure a good number of rampages if you plan to build multiple rampage weapons. That will turn off most people from building this weapon line because rampage isn't the best game mode. But the drop rates are way better than Camellio's Gems and Narga Kugamero's, so you just need to complete 6 rampages to get the full weapon. Like if this video is helpful to you. Consider subscribing if you want to see more content like this. That's all I got for this one. Greedy Knight, signing out.